I'm going to be playing Retro Rewind, but I'm only going to be using outside drifting bikes. So we are going to be starting with Dry Bones on the standard bike S. Um, I just want to quickly say thank you for 200 views on the last Mario Kart Wii Retro Rewind video that I did. I'm going to keep trying to bring out more of these on probably a weekly basis. I would say daily, but trying to manage uh, work right now, so you know, been kind of busy. But uh, we will be, I'll be pumping out more of these as uh, you know. Pretty much every, almost every day, probably two to three a week. But, uh, we're just gonna be doing a, a little bit of a gauntlet, all of the outside drifting bikes. We're gonna start, with, of course, with the lightweights. Um, hopefully, get a first, maybe a top three at best, but at least uh, do something. Now, even though I was expecting a lot of funky flame runners, I'm not seeing as many as I thought I would. I was expecting a full lobby of them, but now, I saw I saw a Rosalina in the honey coop. I saw a Daisy in the uh, in the wildling. Yeah. But you know, might be people playing randomized combo. Might be people just using vehicles that they think are underrated. Which honey coop is the best uh, best uh, large cart. So. I don't care about the flame flyer, I just care about the honey coop. Because it's the it's the only one that looks like an actual car, so it's the best. Oh lord. Not off to the greatest start, men. I'm in the top five, but there's only ten people, so it's not too great. I'm doing average. Oh, that's not a good. F that is a terrible throwing arm. Why does he throw like that? He throws left hook. I didn't know Dry Bones threw left hook. It'll probably be rough at first because lightweights are like the, you know, it's difficult being a lightweight character because you just get bumped around constantly, so. And especially add in the fact I'm using outside drift and this could be a little bit of a struggle to start with, but I'm not going to try and weigh on the negatives too much. We're just going to try and focus on uh, making a quick comeback. I would, I would say that, but I just fumbled that pretty badly. I can still get one last item box, maybe be able to get a mushroom. Oh, king mushroom. Okay. I can get second, I can get second, I can get second. Easy. Okay, cool. I got second. I'll take it. I'm not sure if this is a high uh, high VR lobby or not, but... I don't know, let's get, these guys seem like they're pretty okay, so I mean... Okay, we got a 20k and a... Oh, just a 20k and a 13k. I could try and join a new lobby, but I feel like that'd be kind of pointless. I feel like this is uh, already a little bit of a unique challenge enough, so we'll just we'll just keep it going in this lobby. I am still trying to like kind of figure out audio settings to make sure it's not too loud, too quiet. But... All right. Uh, well, there's only one bike left on the. I got the bit bike. Uh, I'm not sure which one's considered the worst vehicle, but I feel like Bit Bike has got to be the worst for uh, lightweights. There's just not much to it. It's good for for like 500 CC. That's about it. Uh, okay, this is already starting out bad. That mini turbo set must be bad. So there's that. I think uh, next to the Quacker, this might be the lightest. I'm not sure though. So. I'm gonna have a tough time trying to get an item box in that spot. I feel like I don't even have to, to drift all day. Learn a lot. My broken English. That's not great, honestly. 
I feel like bit bike is kind of impossible to play on a track like this, just because of how much uh, how much void there is. Like you're not gonna you're not gonna get very far because you're just gonna be uh, too busy getting bumped off the track. I feel like it might be better to stay in last and try and bag for something, but I don't know. It feels like a feels like a bad strat at the same time. As long as I don't get like horribly bumped off like that. That was unnecessary. The, qu the cool thing about this is it has pretty good acceleration, so... They can't bump me off if I'm gonna start, so... I hope. The bullet could, but... That's bad. That's bad. <laughs> uh, that's my own fault, too, so... Oh, lightning dodge. I'll take it. Go away. Go away. Run on that red shell for me. I'd appreciate it a lot if you didn't bump into me, please. If I can sweep out even, like, a... I missed the last box. It's over. I'm gonna pass. I'm gonna get passed by the uh, girl in the purple. Rough. That was a rough race. That's all right. I feel like first race might have been a fluke, honestly. But let's see. Moving on to medium weights. Um, I feel like the outside drifting bikes for medium weights are probably the worst in the game. I feel like the the lightweights. I mean, they're you got pretty good handling, but medium weights. I mean, like you're just kind of asking to get destroyed. So, it's like yeah, I think about like the sugar scoot and the zip zip. Like those are unanimously pretty not good vehicles. Uh, I'm gonna use Yoshi, just because he's the... he's my best uh, medium character. I know everyone likes themselves some Daisy, but uh... You, know, you got a few people that like uh, Luigi, but uh, that's... no. It's Yoshi. Yoshi's the best medium weight, and you can fight me if you want. I'm not mad at it. Royal Raceway should be fine, I think. Especially for the scenario that I put myself in. There's a lot of uh, Wild Wing players I'm noticing. And by a lot, I mean two. Which is a lot for Retro Rewind lobbies. Okay, so Standard Bike so far doesn't feel bad. I actually don't hate it. Ooh, that's bad. It's my own fault, but it's not good still. Oh, I probably should have waited. I should have struck them uh, after the cannon. I want to go visit Peach's castle. If I fall really behind, I'll go visit Peach's Castle. That's not good. Okay, bullet. I could bag, but I don't trust myself to bag. Because usually every time I try and bag, it ends bad. Bag ends bad. So I should have bagged, because then that wouldn't have happened, but... <laughs> uh, 
So I feel like this lightning is incoming, so I could... Gonna strike after the cannon? I'm surprised. Get the most out of this. Give me some good. Another golden, I'll take it. So, strat I'm gonna play is just go off road pretty much. Go off road as much as possible. Cut off as much of the track. In fifth, this guy's gonna either hold onto his red or he's gonna throw it behind him. That's my own fault. It's fine. It's not over yet. If I could please go off the ramp, that'd be nice. Last item needs to be a good one. Or second to last item. Oh my god. That actually did the opposite of help me, but it's fine. I beat a, f I beat a few flame runners and I'm busy mock bikes, so uh, I'll take it. That was the only good outside drifting bike for uh, medium weights, so we'll have to take what we can get. Moving on to the sugar scoot. This is gonna suck, I think. At least I feel like it'll suck. The, the sugar scoot is probably the sugar scoot and the zip zip are probably my least used vehicles out of every every vehicle in the game because I feel like I've used a few of the medium vehicles like quite a bit especially like uh, you know when I was growing up I was playing automatic mode you know because I didn't know what manual was and I didn't uh, know what the drift button was so I just used automatic uh, I feel like I definitely used the day tripper of a lot. I probably use the super blooper quite a bit. Uh, but for outside drifting bikes, I mean, I only ever used the mock bike and the dolphin dasher. I didn't know what the sneakster was. So, you know, even if I had everything unlocked, like, I wouldn't use anything but the, you know, some goofy stuff. It was just Yoshi mock bike and funky flame runner. Like. So. About to find out if the sugar scoot is as bad as I think it's gonna be. I do know the zip zip has good off road from uh, you know, from the the uh, shy guy beach uh, ultra. So as long as I I might have to pick like a an off road track just to get a good uh, chance at winning. This thing kind of funky with the handle. Ah, that's rough. I can get ahead and get the get the box of burritos. I don't hate this, but I also don't like it. So. Or what it's worth. Oh, I didn't get the mini turbo. It's all right. Holy. King Boo is so much faster than I am. Give me, give me a star. That's not a star. 
Give me something good. Give me something good, please. Okay, I'll take it. Actually, I really needed something better than that. I thought I was about to fly over the railing. I was like... Beat him! Please tell me I still got 7th. It's robbed me a few times. Barely. Barely got 7th. Alright, moving on to the... The worst medium weight vehicle is Zip Zip. This one might be a bit rough. This will probably be the first last place of the vehicles. And probably the only last place. Because, I don't know, I don't really struggle with anything else, so... Go GCN Serpent. I'm trying to do myself a favor here. Guy's taking his sweet time to vote. There you go. GVAP. Eh, I'm not mad at it. I feel like there's not a lot of off road though, so that's a problem. This is already a bit rough. Off-road stat actually kind of came in handy there. I feel like I can kind of just cut some corners and not really have to worry about it. Don't even think about it. Gold mushroom helps too. Mmm, I'm not not doing too hot. I don't, don't think I'm going to be doing too well this track. That guy's just going all the way around. Okay, bro. That's my own fault, too. That's my own fault. I got last. Nice. Wow, I didn't get last. Yes, I did, apparently. Okay, I got second to last. That's unfortunate. I called it, for the most part. I said this would be the worst race. But... And now we have the standard bike L, the... Wario Bike, Shooting Star, the Phantom, yeah, Phantom, okay, so there's three left, I think, or, there's four left. Uh, not gonna be using, f excuse me, gonna be using, uh, Rosaline, just because. I'm not gonna be using the, the best characters of every, uh, weight class, that'd be stupid. I could have used the worst if I wanted to, but uh, I'm choosing the ones I like. Which I don't. I'm not saying I dislike Monkey Kong. I'm just saying I would rather use people that aren't necessarily top tier. Uh, this is like one Funky Kong in this whole lobby.
Okay, so I'm gonna start off by saying I feel like this vehicle is the worst of the standard bikes. This thing feels like garbage. Might just be me, but this feels awful. Yeah, this might be the worst one. I mean, I need to just purposely get hit so that I can... thing is like very feels like this thing is very bouncy. It's a bouncing around like a lightweight vehicle. It's meant for the heavyweights. I don't understand. Please keep this. I need everything I can get, man. Don't lose this. Let me keep it. 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 Me keep it. Nice. Oh my god, that's stupid. Oh man. Those mushrooms, I'm not sure how useful to- actually, I'm not even gonna bother. I tried, but uh, it's not. Why'd I have to be the, like, the longest track other than Koopa Cape? Give me something good. I'm not even going to go for the double. I don't trust myself. Oh, I should have gone for the double. Don't get hit. I wasn't expecting to do good with that. The shooting star, though, I expect to do decent with. This is the second worst of the medium weight vehicle. The the bikes of the uh, large vehicle. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. But this is the second worst of the bikes. Of the heavyweight bikes. There's a lot of randoms. We have yet to get Mushroom City, and we never will. We have two races left to get Mushroom City. Actually, wait, no, this is the... Wait, no, the standard bike I put below this. I didn't realize what I just said. This is the second best of the outside drifting bikes. Why did it have to be a mushroom?
that bullet might... Okay. So, 7th right now. Oh, I should have saved the golden. I guess now I have to get as much mileage as I can out of it. That was a pretty good line, I think. I need to keep this wheelie. In the box. If I can get something good out of this, I'll take it. Shock. Where's the shock? Give me something good. Nope, I'm gonna get 7th. It's too late. Too little too late. Too little too late. Well. Well, we're on to the best of the outside drifting bikes. I think just out of any... Any, uh... Weight class, I think the Shooting Star is the best outside drifting bike. Because it's it would be better if it had inside drift. It would be better than the flame runner. It is apparently with the uh, the stances. So, and from my experience, it's pretty good. So, we're losing players like as this goes on. Like we're not gaining any players ever. So, look, the last guy's gonna vote random. Delfino Square. Or Delfino. Okay. Delfino. That was bad use. I should have waited until I hit the ground. I was trying to hit the brakes, not keep driving. I am not doing at all good, so... This is a bit of a rough, uh... I might be able to get 5th out of this. Might be too late. Might be too late. It's too late. I got 6th though. I'll take it. I had like 2 good races and then everything else has been kind of trash. Well, it's a good thing they were on the last bike. It's a shame that it has to be the Phantom. Because now this is where I get last. This is a hundred percent where I get a uh, dead last place. Let's go. Presenting <laughs> unanimously the worst vehicle in the game is the Phantom. This is everyone's least favorite. 
And if your least favorite's anything else, then you're just... You haven't used the Phantom before. I think I used this vehicle maybe once or twice, uh, unironically. And then, ironically, I've used it twice. But, uh, this vehicle's not good. Let's see if I get Mushroom City for once. No. I actually got a pretty bad track for this vehicle. Actually, no. Oh, never mind. This looks like it'd be an okay track, maybe. I'm not sure. I haven't played Remix uh, VL2 yet. That's nice. Wheelie bump off the start. That's a great start, honestly. I'm so happy right now. I will say, this thing has decent opera, it looks like. It's a funky on the shootings. Funky on the SS. Oh, this thing is terrible. I'm only just starting to realize. Don't hit the phantom player. You have better morals than that, I know you do. had to happen right at the end. Is this really the race I get last on? No. What? What is my placement? Hello? Okay, man. Well, that was unfortunate. Well, um... Gotta say, that went pretty badly, but it also went just as I expected it would, um, which was to go badly, because, uh, I think I've shown that I'm pretty terrible at using outside drift bikes. I think I'm just gonna stick to my, uh, my Flame Runner and my, my Muck bike, because, uh, I did not do great at all. I'm gonna be completely straightforward. That was pretty terrible. But, uh, hopefully this video was at least somewhat enjoyable to y'all. Uh, if y'all did enjoy, please let me know in the comments or what I can do better for future uploads. Uh, but it's going to be Mikey, signing off.